Oh boy, oh boy, time for one of the better Resident Evils. We're going to do uh, the second part of the Resident Evil 2 uh, storyline. We're going to do Leon B. Scenario. We did Claire A. last time. Resident Evil Now let's see Leon's side of the story. In the midst of the T-Virus outbreak in Raccoon City, Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors, a young girl named Sherry. However, behind their escape was the lone survivor of the Raccoon City Police Department. Leon S. Kennedy. All right. And now what's great about Resident Evil 2, if you've never played it before, I'll let you know after this cutscene. Got here. That guy's a maniac. Why'd he bite me? Stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah, first day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. <laughs> hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. Okay. 
Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Okay. All right. So as I was saying, uh, the game takes place in more, la more or less the same area. Both characters. But... Uh, few things that uh, change, and we're going to find out pretty soon what has changed between the two uh, characters. Now the start is fairly easy. All we need to do is uh, dodge the zombies. We don't need to use our ammo. In fact, our ammo is pretty limited right now. We only have 18 bullets. for uh, little zombie friends to move aside. Now with this cabin key, we will be able to reach this little area here. Glad I can't see anything. There we go. Recognized this area. This is where we picked up the valve handle. As Claire, I uh, guess we can pick up some uh, ink ribbons. Now, don't know if you remember, but when you open that door as Claire, zombies would pour out. And if you open it as Leon, well, zombies pour out. It's the only door in the game that does that. So a bit more dodging here. This guy's going to be a problem. Alright, and now we're going to have a little cutscene yet again. So if you wanted to know why there was a flaming helicopter next to the water tower, there's your answer. So we're going to pick up some healing here. room. I can avoid the lickers here. Lickers uh, are activated by sound. Well, at least that's what they say. Get a bit more ammo. And a file here. I think we've already... We've already read this file, though, so I'm gonna skim through it pretty quickly. Now, the difference between uh, Claire and Leon is uh, Leon starts with a lighter, but he has no lockpicks. He'll need to unlock th unlock stuff with uh, small keys. Some more ink ribbons, if we need to save. 
And let's continue on. Now I imagine we'd want to hit the bottom floor first. There's going to be a few zombies in our way. Unicorn metal to uh, get our first key for the uh, police station. I don't know if there's a uh, damage debuff if you shoot uh, from afar or not. When you don't see a pool of blood, that means the zombie is not dead. And there we go. This is where you find the, uh, the new location for the Unicorn Metal. I don't think we need to go there yet. here for the new for a new item here the the spade key it won't tell you the sort of the key until you check it and now it's the spade key doors are locked unfortunately we need a key card Oh, and there is a shotgun on the desk, which is very nice. Let's go see if Marvin's gonna give us a. Uh... Oh, no, never mind. This we're gonna do with the top floor. It's been a while since I've done the B route. Usually I just play uh, the A one. Where's the key card? Guess I have to go around then. Outside, we should find a few herbs here. I'll leave those two for later on. We might come back here. Always, always check the bodies. Usually ammo there. Oh, there's the valve. Excellent. All 
Alright, so back through here. We're gonna go deal with the uh, flaming helicopter. And we're gonna meet up with uh, one of our friends that will uh, accompany, uh, com accompany us for the uh, rest of the run. And uh, we're gonna use it right here. A little valve. <laughs> I forget if there's ammo inside. There was ammo for, uh... Oh, there is ammo. But not the, the kind I was expecting. Well, regardless. Let's get those shotgun shells. Alright, so... She win our buddy now. This is a tyrant, also known as Mr. X in uh, Resident Evil 2. He's, uh... Quite a fun guy. Now we can no longer ever return here. So we turn the corner and, uh, how do you do? Now you can fight him. Dodge him. I'll see if I can dodge him. Oh, that's not a dodge. That's a dodge. Actually, I don't really need to be here. Hopefully, he's not back there. Shouldn't be. Yeah, well, we dodged it somewhat. I don't think I'm gonna need the shotgun. Uh, the handgun parts, uh, no, that's in, uh, that's in, uh, Resident Evil 3, Nemesis, where when you kill the uh, Nemesis boss, he will drop items, and from there you can get the upgrade for the handgun, the, the shotgun, and I think the Magnum, not 100% sure. There's a ton of zombies here. Let's, uh, whoops. Take care of this guy pretty quickly. How do you do? Now there should be... Two herbs here, yeah. I think it's the same passcode. Yes, it is. A bit more uh, shotgun bullets. 
And that's taken care of. Oh, got a friend here. <clears throat> now, fortunately, this police station no longer has the nerve gas that. Uh, whoa. The nerve gas that uh, the outbreak police station has. Let's unload some ammo here. Already dead? Not surprising. Yeah, it seems so. Ah, we're pretty uh, stocked up on items, though. I'm not uh, not too happy about that. there I think we can uh... oh can we go to the library or is it locked you know what let's check the map that seems to be that doesn't show okay I know where to go I'm just gonna unload some items we're gonna go into the interrogation room Put away that, put away that, actually. Um, if we need some, uh, Some room, I'll just eat the herb. Yeah, the police chief really uh, did his best to have everyone killed in the police station. Going to uh, lengths as uh, shooting them in the back, in, uh, as we saw in one of the files. the upgrade to the handgun is uh, hmm upgrade to the handgun is on the second floor Right, there's a liquor here. Liquors are pretty powerful. There's nothing here. Thought there was a key here. Bullets. Jeez, talking about being lost here. Where's the key card? I think I have an idea now. 
Now when you mix the green and red uh, herbs together, it makes a full heal. When you mix two greens together, it's uh, it will heal you from orange caution to uh, fine. And a single herb will uh, heal you from uh, yellow to yellow to green. I think I know where to go, and it's back on the second floor where we where we uh, put away the fire. I think that's where we're going to find a key card. <laughs> well, what makes the games great is... Uh, it's survival horror. Basically, you're stuck in an area where you have to... where you have to survive and... basically, uh... problem-solve your way to uh, victory. With a lot of things that want to kill you. I like this guy. I'd rather kill them since we're gonna come back here. And we will find shotgun ammo in the other room. I think so. Now it's much more fun for uh, new players, I would guess. I've played this game so many times. Doesn't show, but... Uh... Alright, I think there's shotgun ammo here. That's not how you use that. There we go. I was not crazy. Ah, there's the card key we were looking for, and there's a, another liquor here. No, you don't. When he does that, uh... That gesture there, uh, he's gonna do a jumping attack, and he, if he hits you with that jumping attack, that is huge damage. Might even one shot kill you if uh, you're low enough. But we're uh, definitely spending too many shotgun bullets here. Now, but if you don't like backtracking, though, uh, the Resident Evil series may not, well, the older ones at least, may not be for you. A lot of backtracking, a lot of uh, finding out uh, areas that are locked that you'll have to come back to later on. I think this one is still locked though. Right? Uh, it's possible. You can check out the uh, the owner by checking it. Oh, hello. 
Now we want to keep our bullet, keep our shotgun bullets here. So let's. Uh, he's not dead. Come on now. Remember, we could unlock these desks with the, uh, the lock picks. We're not gonna do that for our, uh, for Leon right now. We're gonna need her uh, the small key for uh, our weapon upgrade, which will happen soon enough. All right, so basically that's the code we put into the small locker earlier. I think there there is a charm in not knowing where you're going because it makes it much more stressful thinking okay I don't know what's over here could be zombies well you could hear them but it could be a monster but no there's nothing though there is one thing that is great about uh, the B scenario they always mix it up a bit, like right over here. Now normally you would just see arms sticking out, but uh, not this time. Now we got little zombie friends. So we're gonna light the uh, fireplace here and get a nice little crystal. There might be some ammo back here. Double check everything here just in case. We read that before. I'll take my time for files that we haven't read, but the, the ones that we've already read, there's no real point. Huh, now we got a little situation here. We got two zombies blocking our way. We could take the hit, or we could blow his head off. I think that's a better option. No zombies here. Two herbs? Might as well take one. Go into this room. This is a save room. This is also where we developed the film with uh, Claire. Also, you can uh, change your costume here. If we had a special key that we do not have. Also, there should be ammo here. And should be ammo here. No ammo. And there's nothing in here. So we're gonna combine the ink ribbons together. Gonna head outside, pick up the uh, the herb here. I think 
There's zombies here. There were there weren't any zombies with Claire. Oh no, never mind. Guess that's only in Resident Evil 3. Yeah, it's possible. Alright, so push that in. Push the other side in. Now you need to push both sides to get the crystal, but we're gonna come back anyway, so it's not a, a big rush. A lot of zombies here. Good thing we have a ton of ammo to unload. Well, we got a crawler here. Enter the star's office, and I think that's where we're going to meet uh, Claire once we find the uh, Chris's diary. Now, Chris is the uh, protagonist of Resident Evil 1. Now, I just want to double check something out here. Aha! Jake was wrong. Uh, the stars members the uh, we uh, learn about them in Resident Evil 1 now this is just fluff we can uh, we can leave now well more or less we can leave because we can get the magnum here This is the uh, desk of Rebecca Chambers, the protagonist of Resident Evil Zero. Uh, the enemies take more or less uh, seven to nine hits of the handgun. It's not that random, but it's slight. Oh, I'm sorry. Depends on the difficulty as well. He's not dead. Oh, no. Never mind. He is dead. Hey! Wait! So that's Sherry. We learn it. About her in uh, Claire's uh, scenario. She is the daughter of the antagonist in this story. Oh, we want that. Let's chow down on a herb here. We were in fine, but we were we weren't full health, so. for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course, but before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Yes, boss. All right, so this is where we're gonna find our first upgrade. <laughs> Handgun parts. A 
forget what's in here. Ah, yes, this one. So if you remember, we've uh, shut down those shutters as Claire. In the Beirut, uh, those shutters are now busted open. Good question, 98, I think. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna show you guys the puzzle. I always do it, but I never show it. That's what you have to do. It's pretty, uh, pretty simple, to be honest. Oh, that's pretty simple, except when you do that. Claire had to pick up stones, uh, Leon has to pick up uh, little pegs here. Fortunately, we do not have the room for that. I'm gonna go make some room. Because we also need to pick up the... Uh, the gemstone that we left behind. So we already got 50% of the puzzle done. Come back, pick that gem up. Uh, we should probably reload our shotgun here. We're going to leave our magnum here, never going to use it until the end of the game. Leave our shotgun shells, actually, let's put them all together here. And, uh, so we got two sets of keys. Let's check out this key right here. The diamond key. Also, let's save. It's been, uh... About uh, 30, 40 minutes that we've been playing. Ignore that. All right, so uh, hmm. No, we're not going to pick that up just yet. Not yet. Now, the real question is... Where do we use our other key? Is it right here? Oh, no, it's right there. Okay. Actually, just in case I die, that's more likely to happen. Is there anything here we need to pick up? There is some film. Broken lock. Oh, might as well, uh, might as well head back to the film. Oh, uh, Jake is hosting me. 
don't you worry. I'm not pulling those no those numbers uh, usually. He feels in a generous mood. Alright, so film B, we've already checked that out. It's a guy that died turned into a zombie. Well, then again, Gacker, I've always been professional, am I right? <laughs> oh, oh, what's this? Wait a minute. Isn't this where we see Marvin? Oh no, not like this. Oh, double kill. That was pretty good. Get back, you freaks! Now, if you ask yourself, why didn't I upgrade my handgun? Oh, why didn't I let this zombie bite my leg? Well, there's many things you might ask yourself. But the reason why I did not upgrade When you upgrade your weapon, you get a full set of uh, ammo for free. Green herb here. We got another key, which is nice. Why? Uh, out of space here. We gotta unload these keys. Okay, so there is one key we can uh, take care of right away. This as well. Shotgun ammo, our favorite ammo. Everything happens for a reason there, Sid. Don't you worry. Alright, so let's get rid of key number one, right here. Uh, we don't really need a extra ink ribbon. We're gonna push this here and uh, I think there's a first aid up there. We're gonna take that. Extra healing is always nice. We have the hard key. We have access to uh, a few areas. We're gonna leave it here for now, though. No falling rocks in this one. We're not in a hospital. Not a decent one, at least.
So back where we fought the, uh, fought the liquor there. Now, last time we did this part with uh, Claire, there was a liquor that jumped out the window. Not this time. Except if you take the first aid spray. Whew, I got spooked there. Head to the upper floor. We're gonna do, go do the uh, little uh, gemstones right away. But, I mean, if you were new to the game. You'd have to explore pretty much everything, read every file, and then find out, oh, okay. In this statue, I need to use the, uh, the two gemstones to... Two gemstones that I didn't pick up. Uh-oh. Whoops. Didn't know this was amateur hour. So we're going to go back around and uh, pick up our item. Also, there is a red herb here. Better pick it up. Better mix it with our green. Make a full heal. Go in the back. Pick up our... Uh, our reward for solving that puzzle, which was a uh, peg. Plug. that we completely forgot to pick up. Can we pick it up, please? There we go. Jeez. Oh, the night is still young. I got some monsters to kill. This was a very, uh, very busy day, streaming-wise. Played some Killing Floor, we played some Outbreak. Now we're finishing up Resident Evil 2. Fortunately, I won't be able to uh, stream tomorrow. Wanted to do uh, start the Redemption Week. Redemption Month, actually. We're going to go through every single failure of Two Hours of Hell and uh, see if we can do better than last time. 
One day I will be busy for the day, unfortunately. Yeah, the zombie day. Hey there, Pepsi. I like how they changed the sound for the area. open his chest and inside another plug I think there might be more ammo yep oh. ribbons don't need that yep it's the GameCube version So, now that we have four, uh, uh, three out of four plugs, let's get rid of that, and uh, let's get our key here. Should I bring more shotgun bullets? That should be fine. Well, Claire is a rebel, you know. Driven into, uh... To Raccoon City on her motorbike with a knife strapped to her shoulder. I wouldn't mess with her. this place out. Yeah. Don't have time to waste here. Yes, definitely. Okay, clearly invincible. I don't really need to kill them because I won't really I won't come back here, but uh, I mean might as well. They did kill Marvin after all. Wait a minute. Uh, we need a club key. Alright. Usually there's dogs here, but I think there's liquors now. Nope. Bambos. Welp. Just 
guy's not dead. I should be careful here. I'm wasting a lot of bullets. Killing zombies is so much fun. puzzle in the series. So if you go up, it'll add 36. If you go down, it will remove 14. So up, down, up, down, up, down, and uh, you got it done. Forget if there's items here, though, beyond that. And we need the club key for that. Okay. Actually, I just want to check something out. Actually, I just want to run through the hallway a few times. I don't really need to come here. I just want to see if there's a red herb out here. There is. Now, if you went down there, this is where you would meet Sherry for the second time as uh, Claire. And that's where you would get a uh, the uh, club key, I think. And this is where Leon ruin his li ruins his life for the rest of uh, his Resident Evil career. Meeting Ada. Sorry about that. When I saw the uniform, I thought you were another zombie. Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm looking for some guy named Ben. He's one of those reporter types, always looking for a scoop. I heard he was locked up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? They're pretty strong. Let's be honest here. That's a, that's not a small car. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Ada, wait! We're not going to take it since we've already done the, uh, 
already done the films for uh, Claire. Alright, so check out the jail cell here. There's nothing inside except some herbs. Blue herb? We might do something with that. I mean, only scrubs get poisoned, but you know, we uh, won't take a chance here. Let me guess. You must be Ben, I like, right? I like how Leon now. is such an asshole here. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben? You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. <laughs> Welp. Guess uh, we got to do that. So we're gonna need a uh, spare uh, spare slot there for our manhole opener. Yeah, you can play as Ben in File Two. In fact, you meet Ben in File Two. He's uh, in the cell. He's the one where you trade film with to get items. Also, if uh, you trade him a secret file, he'll give you a plate. You need five plates to... Oh no. Doggos. No men. Oh no. Don't tell me. Don't tell me I just got poisoned. I wouldn't be able to live with myself. Oh. <laughs> oh jeez. This guy's too much. Every time I say that, I get poisoned. So to cure uh, poison, you have to have a blue herb. All right, we're gonna save here. The reason why is we're gonna control Ada. Usually you don't die with it with Ada. She has a gun, she can defend herself, but I'm not gonna take any chances for playing casually here. So 
can't do anything here, but you go into this room. Check out this door. Tells you that you need the plugs. Head back outside and cutscene. Ada? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. <laughs> she just doesn't care. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. And she does everything in her power to just ditch him there. Poor Leon. Story of his life. How cute. That little girl must have dropped this. I think I'll hold on to it for her. Alright, so that was Sherry. Running away. <laughs> we got ammo, so... Might as well use it. Also, her gun fires a lot faster than uh, the other guns. Also, she fires it from the side. Don't know why, though. So remember that power puzzle we had to do with uh, with Sherry? We have to do it with Ada. Uh, actually, let's do this the right way. So you push the uh, block here. It is a lot quicker than uh, the eight-year-old girl, and she's a lot faster. So already done, something that uh, Sherry would take uh, at least uh, 20 minutes to do. Yeah, we have to find a race, me and Jake. Something interesting. <laughs> uh, he's not wrong. Actually, this is a mistake. No! Oh well. Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! Got it. All right. 
So now we have access to a new area. Yeah, I can't believe I missed that. Amateur hour, I tell you. Well, at least I'm not a double scrub. At least. I mean, we could deal with the dogs, but there's no point. Now we are very short on ammo, especially when we uh, sleep on most of them. No time for doggos. There are liquors here. Nope. Thought I put you on auto there. dead. Now I, I think y'all remember this area. This is where Jig died. Jake died in his Resident Evil 2 challenge. Fortunately, we're not all bad at Resident Evil, am I right? <laughs> card here to uh, get some ammo and get the items we left behind with Claire. Magnum bullets. Actually, let's get our uh, side pack first. see with the side pack we now have 10 item slots Actually, the reason why they ask you is uh, at the uh, basically um, you can head here as uh, Claire in the first scenario, and whatever you don't take, you leave behind for the second guy, for Leon, Leon B.
So the reason, like I said, why they ask you is... Uh, Well, you know, the game doesn't really tell you. It's fairly cheap, because if you were... If you think about it, you know... If it's the first time you play, you would take everything, right? Like, why leave anything behind? Uh, there should be magnum ammo here. Knock him down. Alright, so, remember the puzzle here? We had to... Well, I'll show you. Basically, uh... Something on the wheel, like the queen, the king, and the jack. And right here, there's, uh... Number 12, number 11, and number 13 on the other side. So what you need to do is light a fire here. Light the 12, light the 13, and light the 11. And with that, you get the cog. Also, we get Mr. X. Well, that's fine. We can just, uh... We can just escape, and he will not be a problem for us. So go through here. Well, not much of a problem anyways. Let's see if we can catch him by a corner here. Uh, got hooked here, but it's not that bad. We can survive. So now that we have the cog, let's head to the uh, upper floors here. 
No, there's no reason to fight him at all. Don't worry, we will fight him for real eventually. Gloves will be off. Oh, hey there. Drop our magnum bullets here. Drop our handgun. Won't really need it. Get some shotgun bullets. And uh, I think we should be good with this. This is where we meet uh, Irons, Chief Irons, so the Chief of the Police Department. As Claire, unfortunately, Leon does not meet him. And this is where we put the uh, square stones into the painting, which leads to a secret area that leads to the sewers. But we're not going to head there. I wonder if Mr. X is going to show up. Okay, we got the crank. We got the diary here. Don't know if there is ammo. Don't think there is. But I leave you right there. Come back. Surely he's gone by now, right? Uh. All right, we'll have to go fast. Ow. So yeah, that's what's fun about Mr. X. He will uh, follow you everywhere. we get that final ping, we'll be done with the um, police station. So we'll climb up the stairs here and uh, take your right. Haven't taken uh, this area yet, but this leads to the third floor. There might be a liquor on the way, though. No, there's not. Might be a liquor in here, though. No, 
No, there's not. Good old crank sound. And we're going to use that again. Up the stairs. Go around. Put in the cog. Press the button. And... What do we find inside? We find the final plug. Also, we can jump down. So no, no backtracking for us. Leon is a madman. Also, Ben gets totally wrecked, unfortunately. Ben! Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co conspirator. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Goodbye, Ben. Leon. All right. I don't know if we've read this one, so I'll uh, go through it slowly. Actually, I think we we did read this. Yeah, we definitely re read this. So basically, Birkin is working with uh, Chief Irons to uh, to do the research for the G virus. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada! Wait! Hey! Leon, are you still there? We're leaving. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be alright, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! Man, why doesn't anyone ever listen to me? Yeah, so as I was saying, uh, Birkin was paying off the... Uh, paying off the chief of police to uh, get rid of the uh, failed experiments and hide the... Uh, hide what was really going on with the Umbrella Labs. Hopefully I don't get poisoned on the way. The uh, the dogs will bust through the doors eventually. But uh, there's no point in waiting. We're not gonna come back here. I don't think I got poisoned there. It's only when they spit that uh, you get poisoned. 
Yeah. All right, are you ready for the first boss fight of the Leon B campaign? We're not going to bring our uh, shotgun this time. We're going to bring our magnum. Also, we're going to bring a save. and uh, get our magnum ready. We're gonna rock. Alright, time for William Birkin. So this is the first time you meet Birkin as he's evolving with the G-Virus. There's a uh, magnum upgrade. You, you might be uh, mixing things up there, so. I might need the valve handle here. So I'm gonna go get that. I mean, we could save again, but I don't think I'm gonna die. to the sewers. Ada! With Super Ninja Ada. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got bent. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together. Okay? Alright. We'll do this your way, for now. Poor Leon. No respect whatsoever. Don't really need it, like I said, but uh... so management facts we don't need. Handgun bullets. That's been a while since we saw that. 
this for the secret room. Just, I'm pretty sure we're going to need it. Oh boy, it's dark. There's a lamp here. Shotgun bullets as well. Nice. And I think that's all you can find here. Yeah, just double checking here, and uh, yeah, that's that's about it. So let's uh, let's see Leon play the hero. Leon, that woman was. I have to talk to her. <laughs> yeah, sure. You got shot, but I mean. There's no time. I mean, bullet wounds usually heal themselves, so we should, we should be fine. Unfortunately, uh, it is a lot quicker than Sherry, so the bugs aren't a problem. That's what a crack shot there. Don't move. You're the one who was with that cop, if I'm not mistaken. Identify yourself. Ada, Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? How did you know? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... precisely... My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. 
None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Where did you get that pendant? It looks exactly like the one I gave Sherry. She dropped it. I've been holding on to it for her. Liar! Give it back to me! <laughs> <laughs> Too bad. That was a pretty good right hook there. Alright, so what was inside was... That little purple capsule was a sample of the uh, G-Virus. Don't really need to uh, pick up anything here. All we need to do is uh, go and see the alligator. He's gonna take care of Ada for us while we wake up from our gunshot wound. Uh, pretty close to the heart there. Don't know how she knows that it's not fatal. Doesn't look fatal. Right, we got a few items to pick up here. Exactly what this is. Alright. I forget what's in here, though. Ah, the reason why we brought the valve here. a lot of ammo here so and we can't pick it up because we got no room hmm well that's an issue is there a box nearby oh we can do one thing though Yeah, I think in the uh, in the labs. Oh, that was close. the valve here to uh, bring that up. Now 
this might be a mistake. I might have to eat my green herbs. But, I mean, seven ammo for the shotgun. Pretty practical. Alright, so, one of the more silliest bosses in uh, Resident Evil. Claire. Leon. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. That's two I owe you. Don't mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? That means you're Never single? Mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. Uh, herbs here, unfortunately. I like how she patched him up over his armor as well. For a wall, go around the big loop. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. No spiders. Well, that's not a nice spot. So now we're going to take the, uh, the lift here. A magnum ammo in here. Nope, guess not. My boss time. Yeah, unfortunately, no uh, spark gun.
It's gonna be a pain. Is there any ammo here? No, nope, guess not. There's a Resident Evil movies? Yeah, of course. There's like uh, seven Resident Evil movies. Alright, remember the flare that we didn't have the lighter for with uh, Claire? You can now see the key here. with our machine gun. Eat lead sucker. Alright, in the back here there oh darn. Well we can come back. A bit like last time we'll have to come back here to get our upgrade. Yeah, like uh, Lucas said, the um, live-action movies are pretty trashy. We finally arrived. There must be something hidden here. handle anymore. We'll bring the shotgun. We will save us. Actually, we're gonna get the upgrade first. Last time we found the uh, the spark gun on that zombie. This time we find the shotgun upgrade. What's fun about uh, Leon is uh, most of his guns have upgrades. a blue herb we won't bother with that let's go up might as well heal ourselves to max before we uh, 
take the save point. And after that, we're going to hit the Umbrella Labs. Alright, so let's put that there. Don't really need all these weapons, though. Last time there was the lift to the uh, to the Umbrella Labs. Unfortunately, uh, Claire already picked it, so we have to bring it back. She wrote it down, and she had to fight Birkin. No, it's no uh, it's no two hours of hell. It's only a casual run here. Alright, so we have the control panel key to uh, call the lift back. Also, we can check out this camera here. That is such a great cutscene. So we will combine into a super shotgun and kiss the floor there, buddy. Oh, he does drop items. Yeah, yeah, it has more bullets and more. Uh, more bullets and it's uh, stronger as well. Let me go talk to Ada here. Let's go. Well, let's drop our handgun bullets. We're not going to be using that. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, it was uh, pretty scrubby there. We go. No, I've never played black and white. Don't even know what kind of game is it. Is that with the uh, the gods? It's an RPS. No, that's not. Okay, yeah. Okay, so it was the RTS uh, God Building game. Okay. I think there is ammo here. No? Come on. Let's 
<laughs> Never mind. Just need one bullet. That's all I need. Favorite character in the Resident Evil series? Rebecca Chambers. He's not looking so hot. Uh, Greg is a good character, though. I'm on the fence here. Spooked me. Oh, that's not a good, good move there. combo here. I think he's dead now. See you later. Yeah, basically, uh, in the B version, Claire already beat him up, so... Uh... Welcome back. Uh. Hey, take it easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But... I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go. Save yourself. Is it just me, or does everybody always ignore what I say? I told you, it's my job to look after you. But... You'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time. But I really enjoy being with you. I... I know, I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but <laughs> I don't want to lose you. What is even going this on? Place together. Wait here for me, I'll be right back. Watch where you're putting that hand there, Leon. Alright, so... Ada's now in love with Leon, so he's hooked. Poor guy. Also, I love how uh, Leon's so casual about all of this when, you know, everyone's dead. Got a kitty cat here. So there is the elevator. Let's check out the map here. We gotta turn on the power. Next to the Magnum, which one? The uh, the herb? 
This is a mixed herb. It is a mix of red, green, and blue. The ultimate healing item. Totally forgot about this puzzle. I think we've read this one though. Anything that can uh, one shot kill you. I definitely hate to uh, deal with it. Also, I hate to deal with dogs. I hate to deal with... Uh, in fact, anything that's not a zombie is a huge problem. Alright, so... I think we need to bring a box all the way up here. Yeah. Better get pushing. Okay, well, that answers that problem. Also, we needed to, uh, to get the power room going for the uh, for the elevator. Oh, you hear that? Lots of liquors. chances here. There's an iron smelting pool there. We might see that uh, come into play later on. In fact, it might come into play right now. Uh, who knows, Shen? It's possible, but uh, I don't think it heals injuries. So we're going to come back here later on. So, to the elevator we go, we're uh, about 80% through the game already. About 30 minutes to go.
Resident Evil... Resident Evil, it's been two hours. But uh, without break, probably more than that. That damage. Let's take care of the naked zombies here. I forget if we see Ada here. No. Ada? Where did she go? <laughs> that acting. 10 out of 10. Nothing else here? Alright. Let's keep going. So a bit like uh, Claire's run. We're gonna have to uh, get the main power. Stayed. That always uh, that is always good. Use case and the lovely little animation here. No reason to do this, but they still did it, which is pretty nice. Fuse now. in the in the huge breaker here I've played uh, House of the Dead 2 that's the only one I I know I played 3 as well at the arcade but that's pretty much it We can pick up the flamethrower, but it's really garbage. Alright, so we can pick up the lab key card. With that that'll open up a whole lot of areas in this level. We got super liquors though here. Not so super anymore. And in and in here we should find two packs of 
shotgun ammo. There we go. One part of that puzzle we'll have to do with with uh, Leon later on. No, this is the normal uh, U.S. version. Now, plants are really uh, strong against uh, all weapons. Fortunately, so we'll have to be careful here. Well, they're not strong against flamethrowers, but the flamethrower in Resident Evil is garbage. So basically what we did was uh, we traded uh, shotgun ammo for... Uh, Magnum ammo. Now this room, we don't really need to do it, because, uh... Because basically that's what uh, Claire has to do. Leon has another route he has to take, basically the power room that we saw earlier. We didn't have that with Claire, Aaron. Claire A, so... I have to take care of that. Shotgun's an all-around great weapon. It's such, it's such a hassle to move around with uh, Leon in this area, though. Be something busting down here. No, nothing. Not yet. Back to the area where we where we uh, blew up the plants.
don't think he met Wesker directly, no. I mean, you hear about him in uh, Resident Evil 4? Beyond that, not really. enough out of you. Running out of shotgun bullets here. Oh, there's a box here, yes. Completely forgot about it. Let's get a map. Let's go register our fingerprint. What's the second part of our... Uh... Oh, come on. There we go. Only took uh, four bullets for nothing. Yeah, that's pretty silly. Especially point blank. locker and inside is the magnum part and now we got the hand cannon it is really powerful Zombies uh, hurt when they uh, bite you. All right, we got the power room key. Probably hurts her pride. That's why it deals so much damage. Alright, we're gonna do a uh, 
Safety save here. We're going to bring our machine gun. Gonna be using that for a while. Except I think I'm gonna need to uh Oh wow, that's actually really good against slickers, that's surprising. this point we need to head to the uh, elevator but remember that uh, fingerprint we uh, we pressed well we're gonna put it in here hey no problem Glenn have a good day What's great is uh, we got a nice uh, spooky music here. Also, we see uh, failed experiments. Machine gun bullets. It's the only area where you can find machine gun bullets. Should I keep the shotgun with me? Yeah, be fine. Actually, I could keep a bullet. So back up we go. I know what you're looking for. You came for the G-Virus, didn't you? Never take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? 
You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. Not the time there, buddy. Master of deduction? Master of seduction, am I right? This heal ourselves with a nice little green. We don't have much healing here, that's surprising. Oh, never mind. Never mind. To the power room we go. It's gonna go deal with our little friend there. how Ada did what we couldn't do for like five battles. Le Leon, please, escape. No. We're a team. I can't just leave you behind. I'm just a woman who fell in love with you. Nothing more. Look at Leon taking uh, advantage of the situation here. Uh. Ada. No. She can't say no if she's dead. Disgusting, Bye. Leon. All right, let's get out of here before everything blows up. Dead yet? Leon, you made it. Claire, is that you? Where are you? I can see you on the monitor. But never mind that right now. Leon, you 
have to go back and get Cherry for me. I left her in the security office. Please, you must save her. Wait a second. What are you going to do? Where are you going? I still have a few exams to take care of. I'm counting on you. Hello? Claire, are you there? Claire! Oh boy. Security office? So. Now we're in the final five minutes of the game. Final ten minutes. Should probably save. Probably should save. The madman is actually doing it. All right, now we'll we get to use our uh, magnum here. So yeah, just set her on the floor there. Very comfortable. Alright. Going down a level beyond. Just rest here for now. Claire should be back soon. Okay. Now, <laughs> I forget if there's any items here. Do a quick check. I doubt it though. There is a box down here. And an item. I might as well save now. Actually, I don't think I'll need this. The final battle. Here we go. I need two slots, but I'm not 100% sure, so... Let's go. Magnum at the ready. Time to use 
this baby. Do you really need seven healing? Yes. Absolutely. Actually, final Mr. T is actually pretty tough. And like I said, it depends if I need two parts. Two empty slots. Five minutes until detonation. That was you, wasn't it there, uh, Ada? No, it's uh, Super Mr. T. Uh, Mr. X, not Mr. T. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, yeah, I needed two slots. Well, now we know we are fully healed. Yeah, pretty much. I'm a sharpshooter, so I should be fine, right? Oh, jeez. Come on, Leon. Here. Use this. Okay. Ada, is that you? Ada! We get the rocket launcher. There are two shots inside. Game over. Game over. And that was the end of Mr. X. We had an extra small key. <laughs> right, so now the final, final boss. It's pretty soon. Oh, well, let's not deal with that. Open the tunnel. Let's clear out a way with the Magnum. Get out of here! Oh, that is so satisfying. Look at that. So satisfying. Another zombie. All right, 
Let's get the hell out of here. Not done yet. What was that? I wonder if you can talk to him. Yeah. Warning biohazardous outbreak imminent. The emergency system has been activated. This train will detonate. Repeat this train will detonate. What's wrong? I don't know. The door won't open. That's simple enough. Alright. This is this. The final boss of the Resident Evil 2. this so uh, there's a nice big hole in the middle there I'm gonna stuff it with a nice little rocket Not dead yet. We're gonna need some uh, a few magnum shots. We should die by the fourth shot, I think. There you go. Disgusting. Let's get out of here. All right, please enjoy the cutscene to the ending. Warning. Resident Evil Warning. 2, Leon B. System has been activated. Each train compartment will detonate sequentially. Repeat. Each oh, train no! Wonderful. 
one's the right switch? Maybe this one? Sherry! Leon! Ah! Can't hold on. Push the switch over there! Got it! Finally, the exit. Are you all right? I'm okay. Where's Claire? Claire? Claire! Right here! Claire! I guess we all made it. They just won't quit! Come on, we have to get out of here! Run! So, it's finally over. Sherry, you look terrible. No worse than you, Claire. Come on, time to leave. Now? What's wrong? Is something following us? We have to go. We don't have any time to waste. Go? Where? Hey, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. Resident Evil 2 Leon B completed in 2 hours 40 not too bad hope you all enjoyed it that'll be it for me for tonight thanks everyone for watching and have a good night